video I have. Um, I'm going to be explaining my my origins and how I came to be the person you know me as today. Okay, so like I was, I guess may state it. I'm I'm a shy 19 year old girl who has autism, who enjoys shows as Word World, Yo Gabba Gabba, Blaze in the Monster Machines, Bubble Guppies, um, Total Drama, and many others. So I will explain. So I was born on July 6, 2004. So yeah, and then I'm like, see, I'm like, like, when I, I, I was like three years old at the time, and like, um, when, um, and, um, so, um, on September 3rd, 2007, that's when the show Word Roll came out, and I was super happy when it came out. I really do. I absolutely love this show as, ever since I was a little girl. It was so cute, and I love the style of the animation of, like, all these things and like animals are made of like words which is very cute i really do i love the show and if you guys probably didn't already know my fair character always has been duck because he's because i don't know why he's always been super cute and i love and my favorite animals are ducks um one year for halloween my very first costume was a duck was a baby duck and i thought it was so cute and then I'm like, let's see, sometime in, uh, it was like August of 2007, that's when Yo Gabba Gabba came out, and I absolutely, I like that show, I really do, it's really good, so, like, I, I absolutely love that show, it was so cool, and, um, so, yeah, like, all, all the characters are really cool, but my two favorites have to be Tootie and Plex. Tootie, because, you know, I have the same personality as her, like, tomboyish, and likes that fun, and Plex, because I love that. The, I, I like how he's a robot, and I actually remember watching an AMV back then. Um, it was like, it was like, they had this, this song, um, Sticks Mr. Roboto. Speaking of Mr. Roboto, so yeah. That's actually my favorite song. Is like, um, like, like, um, I'm pretty sure anyone who, um, was born in the 80s remembers, um, the band Sticks. Like, my favorite song is Mr. Roboto, um, um, so yeah, it was pretty cool, and I love the song. So yeah, another thing is, um, like, um, I was like, in 2008, I was four years old, I found out about the movie Wally, -E, and this movie was so cute. Wally -E will always be a cute little robot, in my opinion. So anyway, um, so, um, I, and then I'm like, an, cut to cut a few years later to um 2014 um um i i've always been a huge fan of bubble guppies ever since it came out but this episode um um called swimtastic checkup was came around at that point and um like here's the thing i had like a like a bumper for for a new show blaze the monster machines was on there and i thought that was pretty cool i wanted to check that out when it came out so yeah, anyway, like, it's the outside segment of Fantastic Chuckle, but it's absolutely my favorite. Like, them, like, Dima and Gobi going inside of Nani. That was pretty cool. I love Fantastic Voyage Adventures. So anyway, and then, um, October 13th. Sadly, I couldn't, um, watch it because I was in a camp for my, for my, um, like, my class. Um, and of course, Tammy and I, we fell out of the boat for some unknown reason. Cause, um, but unfortunately, here's the thing: I cannot, I can't swim. Unfortunately, I just thought that was a shame, to be honest. But thank God we had life jackets, so we could, so we could. And then, um, pretty cool. The camp, uh, the rest of it is, uh, is pretty cool. But then I actually did watch Blaze and Monster Machines. It's absolutely good. It's really good. But I can handle anyone's opinion for anyone who hates it. My favorite character has got to be Zeg, cause I think he's cool. I think he's like, I, I remember, um. A friend of mine, Edward, he was, um, he was obsessed with, like, dinosaurs. Another thing we did watch is, like, we watched, me and my friend Edward, we watched the episode Come to Your Senses, where, of Bubble Guppies, where, you know, where, you know, the episode where, like, Nani breaks his glasses, and, like, he, um, and, like, he, you know, he basically, um, um, had to spend the, almost the entire episode without them. 
And then cut a few years later to like 2018, um, I, I found out about Word World again. It was still as good as I remember it. And then I'm like, um, it was, it was like in November of 2018. Um, I found about an episode I, I don't honestly remember watching when I was a little girl. Um, The Birds. It was a very good episode, but then when I seen what happened at the 6 minute 13 mark was absolutely amazing. It was the scene of, like, Duck taking a bath. And oh my god, it was so cool. It was super cute. And then um, another, a, a, similar, a scene similar to like that, but this time he had a purple shower cap on and he was saying something completely different. It was from the episode Ducks from the Reunion. It was pretty cool. So then, um, cut to like tw- 2019, um, November 30th. I, I, wa- I decided to become a YouTuber. I wanted to. Um, because you see, um, I- I'm not sure if you guys remember telling you that my name is Heather, and there was actually a total drama character named Heather, which, by the way, my that is actually my favorite total drama character, believe it or not. So I decided to n- name a channel after her, and I also, f- I also had a screenshot of Heather, um, f- um, on my on my on my phone that I used to make the thing and. Honestly, when I started YouTube, I never honestly thought I would um, be popular because I thought people would hate whatever I made. I make a lot of interesting videos, like like I made a lot of Yo Gabba Gabba videos, and I made a few clips from Word World too. But um, and then um, and then like cut off to like 2023, I ended up getting um 1.88k subscribers. I love all my fans. I really do. It was, a, it was a really good moment for me. And I've been doing review videos, ep- review episode review videos, um, um, episode review videos, um, um, recreation videos and character impressions. Uh, one of my friends, Hillary Jean Flyle, absolutely likes to talk about some of the scenes in her favorite shows. Another show I like, um, Hey Dougie, was also another good sh- show. My favorite character ha- was Happy the Crocodile, who was always obsessed with water, and he was the 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 youngest of his group, and was, was also the tallest at five years old, while the other squirrels were like six years old. So, um, basically, uh, my favorite episode from the show has got to be the biology badge. I honestly thought they couldn't make an g- episode that good. Like that, like going inside of Enid and and looking through her all the different parts of her body. That was literally the best thing I've ever seen in my life. Honestly, and ever since 2023, I've honestly never thought I would get this far. And I really want to thank you guys for for um supporting me through my YouTube journey. Hopefully to get a million subscribers. So I really do hope you. You guys help me out and it's beautiful i appreciate it guys thank you so much for watching in this video i've honestly never thought i would get this far but anyway thank you guys so much for watching i, I like and subscribe bye